你们好，很高兴又见到你们。我是Cici。好，今天我们要讲的是Easy Steps to Chinese Two轻松学中文二的第一单元的第二课的第一篇课文。Before we start to learn 生词, I want to tell you in this video we're gonna learn a new pattern that is 有的有的。for example, we could use this pattern to express some people are Chinese, some people are American. We could use this pattern to express some are women, some are men. 好,我们先来学生词,有的,有的, which is means some. And the pattern is 有的, and something, 有的, something. Next one, 还, which is means also, also, hi. Sometimes it means still. How to use this hi? If you want to say like um, some people are Chinese, some people are American, also some people are Canadian, like those kind of sentence, you use 有的, 有的, 还有的. Okay, now let's read an example. Li. Can you read characters with me? Actually, in this level, you should read mostly of them. Okay? So, now let's read them together. 我有很多朋友。他们有的是中国人。有的是美国人。还有的 是英国人 Can you translate? Now, I'm giving you a pin here 我有很多朋友 I have many friends We learned 很多朋友 in last video, right? 好他们有的是中国人 他们有的是 That means Some of them Some of them See? The other Chinese and English many times is opposite. 有的是美国人, some are American. 还有的是英国人, also some are 英国人. 好, now let's learn something more. You can see those are all different kinds of classes you are taking in the school. Now we're gonna learn. How to say it? 数学, math. And if you want to say math class, you gotta say 数学课, means class. 体育, 体育. If you want to say physical training class, you gotta say 体育课. 好, 音乐, 音乐, music. Music class, 音乐课 电脑, 电脑 他们在上电脑课, 对吗? 他们在上什么课? 他们在上什么课? 美术课 美术, means art 美术 好, 现在让我们看Examples 我喜欢上体育课，美术课和音乐课。不喜欢上数学课和电脑课。我喜欢上 that means I like to have physical training class. So pay attention. This is 上. 上 here doesn't mean direction up. 上 here is a verb that means to take, to have. 美术课和音乐课 I like to have physical training class, art class, and music class. 不喜欢 Don't like. 
上数学课 math class and computer class. So now we have a verb 上 Before we had 上 which is means up. That is a noun to show a direction. But here 上 is a verb. When we use 上 as a verb, it could be to have, to take, or to go. For example, 上学上学 意思是 to go to school. So 学 here doesn't mean study. 学 here means 学校, school. We had this, we had 学校 in last video, right? 好,上课, we have class. 上十一年级，你们是十一年级吗？ To have class in grade eleven. Actually, that means in grade eleven because you are taking the classes in grade eleven. That's why we still have 上, 上十一年级。now let's see the example. Li. 我今年上十一年级. 我在英文学校上学. 我喜欢上英文课和数学课。好,现在我们看拼音. If you cover the pinyin, can you, can you read characters? I hope you can. 我今年 今年 means this year. Good. This year I'm grade 11. 上十一年级. 我在英文学校上学. We had this pattern in last video, right? Do something at some place and location in front of the verb. I have school in English school. 我喜欢上英文课和数学课. I like to have English class and math class. How? Those are the things we need to talk in this video. I hope you have understand them. If you want to take a quiz, you could go to beautifulmandarin.com. 找到 study resource page to study resource page you could take a quiz here and also if you want me to explain your questions in Mandarin learning you could schedule my Skype class or group class in group class you definitely will meet me in person okay guys I hope you enjoy this video and uh, I hope to see you in next video 再见